I'm at this unsuspicious thing with tons of random junk in my inventory. So I wonder what happens when I place a redstone here. Ooh. No mess. Ooh. Oh, what's it? Oh, boat. That's cool. And the boat will slowly travel up. Oh, this is interesting. Ah. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Boom. And now sand drops down there. Minecart? Oh, that's not even minecart. Oh. Let's check that out. That looks interesting. I put the nether up in the middle so it won't burn to death. If it does burn to death, though, that would be sad. I hate doing things manually. Oh, got on fire. Ooh. Ooh. Burn. Come on. Come on. Okay. Set the block. Fire. That should work. Wait, I totally didn't put the fire there. Shh. Anyway. After this takes ages to burn. You know what? You know what? Ooh, look over there. Did you not see it? You zombie? Yeah. Okay, wait a second. Just gonna do something. I really can't show you. Okay, see the zombie fall out of Oh, it sets the iron golem on fire. And this villager comes up this villager elevator, and that causes this... And then this is the cool part. You see that anvil? And way down there. Boop, 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 boop. And the light is on. To turn the light off is a bit more complicated. So, first... Go all the way down to this guy and press the button. Then you come all the way up here and press this button. And then you press this button and a bunch of complicated sand stuff happens. And then you have to go all the way down there and break that piece of sand. Then you pick up the item. And resupply your TNT mine cards. Oops. Oh well. I can't do that much damage, right? Okay, then you come to a power rail. Regular rail, regular rail, break. And then place your redstone block there. Power this. Okay, then put out the fire. Grab some wood. Boom, 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 boom. Boom. Put a torch on that block. Should see a zombie in there. And that's working. Okay, then you go down to this hopper. Grab the run flesh. Move that sand across. And I'll check down here. And then build your elevator auto resets. That usually auto resets, but you need to grab an anvil, place it here, come travel all the way over here. Remove the anvil, and I think you're basically reset. Yeah. Looks like you're reset and you're good to go again. Bye guys, that's it.